Welcome back. You're watching the Home Buyer's Guide with me, Suesha Savant. This is your armchair guide to some of the hottest properties in the market today, all handpicked by me. Before the break, we took you on a tour of Vistas by K. Raheja Corp Private Limited in Mumbai. It's time to take you to the address at Vakar in Pune. Now, before I tell you about the project, let me first get you familiar with the location of the project. Once upon a time, Pune was considered to be a pensioner's paradise. It was the go-to city for retirees who wanted to settle in a peaceful, tranquil environment surrounded by greenery. It was the pensioner's second home destination. Today, Pune is a vibrant metropolis. Interestingly, Pune is also known as the Oxford of the East. Why? This is due to the presence of multiple educational institutions throughout the city. So if you visit the city, you will not only find plenty of educational institutions, but you will also find many information technology hubs and other industries emerging here. Vakar is a locality in Pune within the municipal limits of Pimpri Chinchwar. It is one of the fastest growing localities of Pune metropolitan area. The phenomenal growth of Vakar can be attributed to the upcoming infotech and biotechnology park at Hinjewari, close to the Pune Mumbai Expressway. In the last four years, the Pimpri Chinchwar Municipal Corporation has granted the maximum number of building permissions for projects in Vakar and its surrounding areas. As a result, it is seen as one of the ideal residential destinations in Pune. It is also close to three proposed bus rapid transit routes, BRT routes, the construction of which is currently under progress. Vakar's close proximity to the Pune-Mumbai Expressway in the west is another point in its favour. It is close to premium areas such as Aund, Baner and Pashan. It is popular with young IT professionals who work at the Rajiv Gandhi Hinjewadi IT Park. Major IT companies here include Infosys, TCS, Wipro, IBM, Tech Mahindra, Cognizant, Siemens and Mindtree among others. It has a well-developed social infrastructure, including schools, hospitals and shopping malls close by. It takes close to an hour to reach from Vakar to Pune Airport at Lohegaon. The Pune Railway Station is 17 kilometers away. For your daily needs and shopping instincts, head to Chroma and Dmart, which is just a kilometer away. So as far as your basic needs are concerned, they are well taken care of. Also, the address is just about an hour away from the Mumbai Pune Expressway. Let's now get you some more details about the builder. As we keep telling you on this channel, it is important to research on the developer before signing the dotted line. Adi Ronal Developers is a renowned name in real estate industry in Pune with a legacy of successful projects that boast superior quality with timely possession. Adi Group offers a winning proposition in terms of investment as well as lifestyle addition to your status. Created to provide luxury that is built to last, every project by Adi Group is a landmark. Now that you know about the builder, let's now dive into the project. And talking about the address in specific, the project is spread over two acres. This project has a total of three towers, which houses nearly 150 units. It has homes in configurations of two and three BHKs. The developers aim to offer utmost luxury in the address. The location is the highlight of the project. Chosen with great foresight, it is complemented by a striking elevation and design. The developers believe that buying a home in the address is a successful investment purely in terms of the value it adds to your lifestyle, making both you and your family happy. The address is the privileged claim of an elite few. It is reclusive, yet it is well connected. Once you step out from your private residence, you enter a neighborhood that exudes verb and zest. The project is nestled in a neighborhood brimming with shopping malls, restaurants and other consumption avenues, thereby offer great convenience and utility. It is also expediently placed from some of the best schools and educational institutions in the city. With a home at the address, you can drive down effortlessly to Baner or the IT corridor in Hinjewari. Living here will make you discover the pleasure of living when your life and work blend seamlessly into each other. 
you can witness distances shrink and the world appearing a lot more connected if you work close by. Sounds really nice, isn't it? But how much moolah will you have to shell out if you decide to buy a home here? Let's find out. With an average per square foot rate ranging between 5,162 and 8,000, the homes here range in sizes of 996 to 1235 square feet. So, a 2 BHK will cost you approximately between 55 to 75 lakhs on an average, whereas a 3 BHK can go up to nearly 87 lakh rupees. The possession of this project is expected by March 2017. Although it's not just the flat but also the amenities that you're paying a price for. The address for one has a designer entrance lobby, an occasion hall to celebrate along with a party lawn, children's play area with rubber flooring to ensure their safety at all times and a dedicated walking and jogging track for grown-ups. From food and beverage outlets for social butterflies to the friendly grocer, everything is just around here. There's a convenience store for all your basic needs and malls for high street shopping outlets. For added bliss, each home is surrounded by a garden that is bursting with life and the bungalows have that extra something with an adjoining pool and deck along with a kids pool, personal elevator and a lot more. Well, that's a long list of amenities and things to do at the address. Plus, the fact that offering luxury is the focus in everything they design in this project, it's the overall package that makes this township a good place to stay in or invest. Alright, so we are done with two of the three projects that I handpicked for you. It's time now for another short break here on Magic Breaks Now, India's first property business channel. But don't go anywhere. When we get back, we'll explore Arvind Citadel by Arvind Infrastructures in Ahmedabad. See you soon.